Not well. I mean, I think the the whole thing about having the the image of the perfect body is very challenging. I think uncomfortableness comes with um, in the gay community around body size and shape. Definitely has to do with um, you know how plump versus how muscular you are. And then we have the group of people that are a little bit larger that kind of try to talk to younger people but you know or smaller people and they just smaller people seem to be weird about it like the guy i'm dating he's a lot bigger than me i mean he's height weight proportionate but he's a lot bigger and he's muscular so he's you know i don't have problems with it but our community does i i don't need someone with a six pack i remember when i first came out of the closet i wanted a big bodybuilder but now i would just feel more uncomfortable if anything i'd be like he could kick my ass at any moment, really, you know? Um, I think um, when it comes to like dick sizes, I think that's, that's one thing. Um, different abilities, you know, um, uh, and, and, and disabilities. Um, we don't see very many gay men out in wheelchairs going to the clubs. I see and hear more people uh, in the gay community being aware of the fact that um, body consciousness and wanting to have the perfect build is not a good thing. That it seems to me the gay community at least has a better sense of, of how screwed up that is. And yet on the same, or on the other side of that, it's, you know, some of these same people, you know, I see them at the gym every time I'm there. So, you know, they're, we are, we are body conscious 